her living and her death will not be in vain. Family and friends of Army Specialist Vanessa Guillen will remember her love of sports and her faith. The country will remember the cause she died for. I would very much hope that the military uses this opportunity to uh, search in debt uh, before they discard any claims. Guillen's family says she was being sexually harassed, but was afraid to come forward for fear of retaliation. Fort Hood investigators found no evidence to support the claims. The Secretary of the Army requested that the Department of Defense do a full independent review of the case. Meanwhile, Houston Congresswoman Sylvia Garcia says Congress's investigation will continue as she pushes for a bill that would take the sexual harassment complaint process to a third party investigator outside the chain of command. It's what we're hearing on many of these cases, and regrettably there are just too many, is that, that the soldier is, is, is afraid of making the complaint because of fear of retaliation, targeting, you know, change of position. They don't trust Fort Hood. Houston Police Chief Art Acevedo says the Guillen family is having a hard time trusting the military and asked HPD to independently confirm that the remains found were, in fact, Vanessa's. Homicide detectives took DNA samples and sent them overnight to a lab in Denver to get confirmation. And we did that because it was the right thing to do and it brought comfort to the family that they were actually bringing their own daughter to rest. Laying her to rest and standing with her family. I am sorry this happened to you and your country stands behind you. In Houston, Chris Costa, KHOU 11 News.